Kenya's hopes of witnessing a Kenyan lift the Kenya Open golf tournament title for the first time were halted after local sensation Dismas Indiza finished a poor 28th at 5 under 283. This year's winners were, determ were, were determined through a playoff after South Africa's Hayden Porteous and Brandon Stone tied at 17 under at the close of the last round of play. Kenya's top golfer Dismas Indiza was among the three Kenyan golfers who made the cut the last day of play at the current golf club where he teed off, placed 10th, hoping to improve his 8 under par in the last round of play. Indiza, who finished 10th at the 2008 Kenya Open tournament, was quite the crowd puller, with most of the home fans hoping for a good show. He, however, could not hold off pressure from home fans and kept on dropping shots to post his worst score over the four rounds. He closed the tournament with a 5 under 283. Ah, my shopping got quite good. I'm not sure how much money I'm going to make. I'm not sure how much money I'm going to make. I'm not sure how much money I'm going to make. I'm not sure how much money I'm going to make. The tournament was on the last day reduced to a duel between longtime friends Brandon Stone, the overnight leader, and Hayden Portiers. The South Africans showed nerve to stay ahead of the field. There's nothing to separate them even up to the last round of play where they finished tied at under 17, prompting a playoff. Portiers carded a dramatic eagle two at the first extra hole to edge out Brandon Stone to bag his first professional title. It's a victory that, you know, I'll never ever forget. Um, you know, unfortunately it had to be one of my best best golfing friends um, you know we've been together thick and thin through junior golf uh, amateur golf and pro golf and you know to win like that was maybe not the best but you know a win is a win he's one year younger than me so we played basically our whole careers together and to have us two in the playoff is quite special and I said to him it's a it's a moment you'll never forget the completion of the 2015 edition of the Kenya Open Golf Tournament here at the current golf club means that the wait for Kenyan to lift this title continues. But the real question remains, can a Kenyan golfer lift the Kenya Open title? It's very possible for a Kenyan to win the Kenya Open, but our preparation and the way the course has been set during our normal tour, the KCB tour, the KQ tour, it's very different. So those are the things that we really have to consider first. Matthew Mondi was making his second professional show at the Kenya Open and despite finishing a poor 63rd, he's glad he made the cut. And in the Open and any tournament, one, one must be having that game plan in order for him to know what to work on, what to do at that particular time. Yeah. The wait for Kenyan to lift the Kenya Yaki Open Baki. title stays on while the tournament continues to be a perfect hunting ground for foreign players. Lynn Washira, KTN.